when you it's easier to understand this when you're writing for other people but it, it this applies for when you're writing for yourself the detective work you guys shouldn't be looking at this yet the detective work that you do you need to get past the company line now as a freelancer I know the company line is the guy that owns the business is so in love with this he's gonna say this thing does this this and this and this is why people buy it almost a hundred percent of the time he will be hundred and eighty degrees dead wrong he will not know why people buy. He knows why he would have bought it, why he got into it. He knows that. That's what I call the company line. And for you and your product, what Stan was talking about, you're, you've been eating your own company line for a while, and you're in love with this product. When I, when I work with a client, I want to talk to the receptionist. I want to talk to the feet in the street salesman. I want to talk to the guy that invented it. I want to get the gossip, the rumors, the because uh, a lot of the guys that have to sell this thing say, yeah, I know that Bob, the guy who owns the company, he keeps saying it does this, but we never sell it that way. We sell it by telling it will do this, something completely different. That's what I want to find, and that's what you want to find too. And a lot of times you just got to get out of your head. You got to get into um, it's other people's opinions of what's going on, and you and you got to strip it down, get your ego out of this, and find out what really is happening, why people are really buying this stuff, what's really going on.